Hello everybody. Today we're going to talk about a pretty common problem which many of us, or not really us, but many practicing musicians or DJs encounter in their everyday practices. So what is this? It's a humming noise. Humming noise which uh, can be different sort, but most of the time when it's amplified through PA, it's getting pretty annoying and sometimes even embarrassing. So what are we dealing with? Pretty much what I will talk to you today about, it will be the humming noise generated by the laptop. Uh, many other pieces of equipment generated sort of similar noise, which pretty much coming from various processors and things like this, so digital gear. So what, how we deal with it? There are several ways to deal with this particular problem. Uh, and right in front of me, we have different pieces of equipment which actually do help eliminate this problem. So let's uh, try to look at the first scenario. So what we have, we have a laptop, we have simple Y cable, usually which goes into a PA system, and that's where we're getting the noise sort of like this. So how we get rid of it? Even this noise, it, uh, now what you can hear, it's a little bit overemphasized, overamplified, but when it's coming through the PA, it's actually audible. So different problems occur because of the different grounding scheme, uh, schemes which running through the house, house power, power system. So in many cases, the equipment fed from different phases and that creates these problems. There is other, other ways to explain it, uh, explain it, but I'm not going to go into details, but the, I will basically jump into the way how to solve the problem. So first of all, if you see, this Y cable is actually plugged into the direct box. Each direct box, at least most of them, cheap or more expensive, we have different representatives of uh, these direct boxes has ground lift switch which is sometimes just mentioned just ground or GND and it can be switchable so by simple by, by simple uh, try, error, trial and error you can find the position which actually eliminate this noise like here for example what, what is happening and we're going back So, as far as you can see, as far as you can hear, the noise actually pretty much disappears. Uh, there is other way. If uh, there is uh, one interesting thing that many DJs don't like to deal with, because the direct boxes require to be uh, to run the signal from the box with uh, XLR cable, not. Not every piece of equipment, especially in the DJ environment, has an XLR inputs. So, how we deal with this? There is another solution. Is this? So, pretty much what we can hear the, the, uh, in this case, how it used when we're running the straight signal, uh, we can notice that if we're running the laptop, for example, and it makes noise. If we disconnect the power jack as of right now, the noise disappears. When we plug in back in, noise appears again. Again, the problem is we cannot run, especially Windows laptops, or, uh, we cannot run them through hours and hours during our gigs and not all the Mac owners wants to do that uh, as well. So how do, how we do this? We have this little plug it actually goes in the rack, uh, in the rack unit as well. But this is the cheapest one. Basically, what we can do, we can plug in into the power outlet, then the, uh, plug the power supply of the laptop over here, and it takes care of the problem. So, so far as you can see, it's a pretty simple solution. It's not too complicated, and it's not very expensive. So 
I guess that will help in your future endeavors in the field of music or DJ or sound amplification. And I wish you good luck.